Thank you, Master. Um, I just want to uh, express my appreciation, uh, especially for the last few nights of, uh, of your Dharma talks. They've been really, really profound, and I found uh, the content uh, super helpful um, to, sh to share uh, something I experienced yesterday during the Dharma talk. I, I feel like I identified a blind spot for myself, and I wanted to ask, um, while we're talking about false thoughts and attachments, um, it occurred to me that expectations are an attachment that I've held. And I haven't heard that I can think of expectations be defined as an attachment. So is, it, is that correct? Expectations are an attachment? Yes, absolutely. Expectations are attachments. Uh, they uh, influence uh, your, your thinking. And therefore, because of your expectations, uh, you will uh, have a certain reaction. You certain, certainly for you, you tend to judge others. That's your biggest, one of your bigger weaknesses is that you are very judgmental. And, and you should recognize it. And you, you actually, for you personally, you justify it by, by, uh, by hiding behind something called expectations. Expe expectations of ability, expectations of proper manners, expectations of observing the rules of traffic and so forth. Okay? And those are, are basically uh, your your uh, your uh, being judgmental, and you only use those as as uh, excuses for you to judge others. It's not about being right. Being right is for losers. Let me repeat for you. You cultivate. You become enlightened, and you think you're right and you, you, you reserve the right to judge others, you're a loser in my book. Okay, meaning that you don't deserve to be taught. Okay, because the more I teach you, the more you judge others. Because what's the point? Okay. The more, the more you practice, the more you make progress, the more humble you should become and stop judging others. Embrace and accept others who they are. Okay. Yeah. I hope you, your generation won't make the same mistakes as my generation. We think we learn from the greatest teacher, therefore we're special. We're not. It's just anyone else trying our best. <laughs>